Every year, 4.7 million European students gain a higher education qualification. Among them are Anne, the physiotherapist, and Rudy, the baker. They'd like to work in another European Union country. But it often means going through this. A real obstacle course. From now on, Anne and Rudy will no longer have to fill in masses of administration forms in duplicate. Also gone are the never-ending delays. Goodbye to incompatible qualifications. Make way for the European Professional Card. It's a sort of personal electronic passport. Its chip is connected to a common database for the 28 member states of the Union. The card is being introduced by representatives of the professions. Doctors, carpenters, opticians, restaurateurs, etc. There are over 800 so-called regulated professions. All are concerned, with the exception of notaries. The aim? To simplify recognition of qualifications and professional training. Useful for a baker like Rudy or a hairdresser. Essential when it comes to a physiotherapist like Anne or an architect. This card also carries an alert system. The aim? To prevent professionals who are barred from practicing from freely setting themselves up in another EU country. An essential safety mechanism in the area of health or in the education sector. <laughs>